Electronics Technician Master Chief Randall Reed. You're the chief of the boat? I am the chief of the boat. Minnesota's role during the Civil War was part of the Union Blockade Forces. Really her job was to uh, block supply ships and uh, other types of ships that were coming into the harbors and river. Connection between Minnesota and Monitor during the Civil War started on March 8th with the Battle of Hampton Roads. It really what initiated the Battle of Hampton Roads is Minnesota had ran aground and the Monitor had intercepted between Confederate ship that was trying to destroy the Minnesota while she was aground, which started the Battle of Hampton Roads. The two ironclads uh, started their war, and which lasted for two days. Monitor engaged in a, a two-day battle, uh, which ended in a draw. Both ships, uh, the Confederate ship as, as well as the Monitor, ended up returning back to their respective home ports for repairs, and then continuing on with the efforts for the Civil War. The historical connection is obviously, uh, we're the third ship in the Navy to bear the name Minnesota. Uh, Monitor was protecting the sailors on the first Minnesota. So there's definitely a historical connection there and uh, just a way for us to pay our respects. For me personally, it's exciting because as the chief of the boat, Command Master Chief, I'm always looking at ways to uh, engage my sailors and, and see, have them see that we actually do more in the Navy as, than just studying and working on qualifications and just all the hard work, that this is actually a chance for us to, to go and pay our respects to the, the sailors of the Monitor for their efforts that they contributed during the, the Battle of Hampton Roads to save the first Minnesota. So it's very exciting, looking very forward to it. It's really special to, to be a part of this, being that they're the last of the, from the Civil War era to be buried. Uh, so 151 years is what we're coming up on. Uh, so being that the Navy has a strong emphasis as, as well as the Chief's Quarters has a strong emphasis on histories and traditions, to actually be a part of this, have my sailors go up and participate in this event is truly special and I think it's something they'll remember for the rest of their lives. We're just really thankful to, uh, to be a part of it. Minnesota, the PCU Minnesota, our submarine is being built here in Newport News in the Hampton Roads area. Uh, so again, just one more historical link uh, between us and the Monitor. So it's really special to be a part of this and, and really, uh, really glad to, to participate in this event.